In this demo, we would like to authenticate to our Linux server running in Google Cloud using SSH key. We're going to walk through the steps of setting up that Linux box with the key. I've already generated an SSH key named demo. We're going to use that key. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the contents of the public key, the one we're going to need to give to Google. So this key here, with or without the comment, is the one that we need to get onto the Linux server running in Google Cloud in order to authenticate to it. So back over here on Google Cloud, I have set up some servers. If you're curious, I'm using the Terraform from the Matilda Terraform project on GitHub in order to set up a GCP environment for testing, but you could set up a Linux server on your own to do this demo if you like. So back over here on the Bastion host, one of the two computers that's set up, I'm gonna click on the name of that server, and then we're gonna hit edit. SSH keys is one of the few things you can actually edit with a running instance. You do not have to turn the machine off. So down here under the SSH keys, I've got one that was automatically installed by Terraform, but this is gonna be a new key for demo purposes. So I'm gonna paste that key in there. You can change this comment at the end if you would like. Now the key here yeah, is in the field, but you do have to hit save and the save button's down here at the bottom. So you gotta click that, wait for the key to get deployed. So what is happening now is, is the automation is going out to the server and it's writing the file out into the directory. So just like we have the file here, demo.pub, there's gonna be an SSH key file now running on this Linux box. So at this point, we'll go ahead and try to access it. So the command we're gonna use is gcloud, and we're gonna tunnel through the identity aware proxy so that we don't need any public IP addresses to get to the host. You'll notice that I've passed the location of the private key, which is in my SSH directory under demo. Up here we used demo.pub and down here we're gonna use the just the, the private key which is just demo without the extension on the end. You'll notice that Google responds by saying that it's taking the key, which is on the Google metadata server, and it's propagating the key. I have to provide the local system the password to unlock the key, because when I created the demo key, I encrypted it or armored it with the dash A option. And now you can see we're logged into the Bastion host with our key. So in this demo, we reviewed how to deploy the public key to the Linux server running in Google Cloud. And we also saw how to use the private key to authenticate to the Linux server that had the public key installed on it.